All right, let's get started with the demo flight of the Happy Model Sailfly X. What I got here is the battery that came with the quadcopter. So let's go ahead and check it out. 3S battery on such a small little quadcopter. Can't wait to see how it performs. I did a little hover test in the backyard and it performed very well. So I'm going to use my Tyrannus QX7S. Throttle warning. All right. All right, and I have it set to the D16 mode, which is the FR Sky X mode in the configuration. It did come with a D8 mode already selected. I'm not sure if I need to do it in the D8 mode or D16. It's supposed to support both modes. So let's go ahead and power this thing up. All right, let's check it out line of sight first. Let's see if it works. There we go. All right. We are good to go. Oh, cow. It just jumps right out of the uh, table. Oh, yeah. Tiny little thing with tons of power. And I am throttling up about 50%. And it is maintaining a nice little hover. Looking pretty nice, too. Okay, so far I don't have any issues with <laughs> issues with uh, the FR Sky X configuration so far. Yeah, it is so small you can't go too far with it. Yeah, it's got lots of power, guys. And that is not even a full throttle. Wow. This thing's got incredible amount of power for such a small quad. Wow. And it is really fast. Okay. So let's go ahead and check it out with a little power punch here. That is the full power punch. One minute. Not bad at all. Okay, one more power punch. Yeah. I do believe you are going to be able to do all kinds of freestyle maneuvers with this thing. It's got tons of power. Very nice. Let me bring it in and see if I can do some acro flying with this thing. 30 seconds. Very nice. Let me bring it in closer. 20 seconds. Yeah, pretty nice. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. I have the transmitter timer set to three minutes. But I think we are pretty good. Real nice. Wow. On such a small little quadcopter framed racer, this thing's got tons of power. 3S. Awesome. Woo! -hoo. All right. <laughs> All right, let's bring it in before I lose it. And let's go ahead and check it out with some FPV here. I got a couple more 300 milliamp batteries that I've ordered separately. So I'm going to check it out with the same size battery, same C rating. All right, so let's go ahead and check it out with some FPV. All right, here we go with our first FPV flight with the Sailfly X. Got another 300 milliamp size battery on here. So let's go and check it out. Let's see how the camera quality is. Okay, 25 milliwatts. And very fish-eyed. Two minutes video feed 
a little bit of static here and there. Hopefully the recording comes out good. Yep, so far really smooth. And I am running default PIDs. And there's my VTX channel F1 on one, so 25 milliwatts. And I am throttling up, as you can see, right about 30 some percent. But my sticks feel like I'm RSSI low. Low. And we do have telemetry. So I do have LUA script function and everything. It works on this quad cutter. So I can change my PA, PIDs and VTX One channel minute. directly from my remote control instead of going into the OSD menu on the Betaflight OSD. But I have options. I can do either one, so that is nice. Okay, so the RSSI going down to about 50, staying around there. So this is not a very good distance type of quadcopter. So let me go and see. Whoa, I got video breakups right there. Seconds. Okay, that's the 100 meter bush. I made it and I'm coming back. And I didn't have a fail safe. And I am able to make seconds. my way back. And let me go behind the car. And there you go. There's RSSI a little bit of low. Yep, RSSI low and video interference as well. All right, so that is the scope of the distance that we are able to travel with this thing. Okay. Reset my timer. We've been flying for a little over two minutes now and we are at 10.8. So we are still good with the 300 milliamp size battery. Let me do a little loop and check that out wow haven't done any maneuvers yet lots of fish eye oh that drained out the battery somewhat oh my god this thing is a smooth flyer Oh, you can do freestyle moves on this thing. Wow. Two minutes. Not bad. <laughs> Superb. Wow. Really? Wow. Nice. Wow. Woohoo! A little bit, a bit of uh, battery drain there. Oh man. You need one of these. This thing outperforms all of the other tiny hoop style quadcopters. Even like the Mobula. Oh my god, that thing is a 2S. I thought that was like incredible. The trash can, I thought that was incredible. This thing is amazing. It's 3S. And I've been flying for over four minutes and it is still hanging in there at 10.4 oh superb 30 seconds wow twenty seconds <laughs> awesome awesome okay I'm gonna go ahead and bring it in Getting down to the 10.3, Wow, five minute two, flight time. One, that is amazing. Elapsed. 
so smooth too. Very nice controlling quadcopter right out of the box. Like I said, default PIDs. I didn't touch anything at all. All right, there you go, guys. Our test flight, the FPV test flight of the Happy Model Sailfly X. Just amazing.